Hi, I'm the Rifter. This is my nightmare. It's been a great one today. It's really not if you can't tell. God, I, I wake up this morning and I go outside, you know, turn on the truck, get in, put them trucks in drive, and I, I start to go forward as one does. My truck starts handling like utter dookie butter. Jeez, okay. So I'm gonna go because it's my turn. <laughs> nice, you ran a red light, you f head. So my truck starts handling like utter dog shit, and I'm like, I get down to the end of my road, I'm like, what the hell? Something's wrong. I don't have to usually press the gas down this far to go. So I get out and walk around my truck. Who throws a screw in the middle of the road? Seriously, there's a screw in my tire. I know you're probably saying, oh, the rifter, it happens from time to time. No, this is just shitty timing. And then people that can't make up their mind, but then they do make up their mind, but then they don't, and they want something else. I do not have time for it. I really should have recorded this episode this morning. I had so much more anger driving to work. So, this is something else that pisses me off. Everyone is sta- You f***ing cock. Everyone else is stacked up, just in, in the damn intersection, and I can't go anywhere. The delayed red light, if I've never told you about it. Now there's a guy beside me, I'm not letting you in, dude. You can get behind me. Thank you. I'm sorry you made poor life decisions. I am not in the mood today. Eat the proverbial dick. No, just eat a dick. God, Jesus Christ. I really don't want to be anywhere near that truck. This guy's got a few pallets worth of cinder blocks balanced by what looks like a Jenga's game worth of cinder blocks underneath. And there weren't that many in the tower. Someone made a bad choice. I'm beginning to wonder what's going to happen next. What's it going to be, you know, Nuclear smallpox? Or what are you gonna throw at me next? Flat tires, people that can't make up their minds, retrograde amnesia, amnesia. I just wanna know what's next. And I know you say you can't prepare for life, but you know what? I would like to be prepared for life. It's Halloween tonight. This is my wife's favorite holiday. I don't have any favorite holidays anymore. I mean, I have to work all of them. I guess Christmas and Thanksgiving would be my favorite holidays because those are really the only ones you get off. Well, <laughs> that you don't have to work. Well, put it that way. Damn, the one red light that I never usually hit just bitch slapped me. Thanks, red light. Nobody's going. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Got your f***ing phone. What are you looking at? I was very mad earlier, and I'm just kind of content now. I just want to go home. I want to pinch a loaf. Oh, that was my wife. That was Rick from Rick and Morty saying thank you. No, it's cool. Don't stop. You don't even have to. Dude, it's perfectly fine that I have to slow down now because you didn't want to stop at the stop sign. I completely understand. Well, at least you're doing 55. Can't complain about that. I'll find something to complain about. Like you almost hit the car that was sitting over there. Sorry, you almost hit the car that was setting over there. I don't like that I'm interchanging sit and set. Like I'll actually say I was setting down and I never used to do that. And I think I've just been in the south too long. I cannot stand when I do that. And I do it like at least once a day. It's very irritating. All right, I'm crowdsourcing from my subscribers at this point. Not money, because let's face it, people who watch me are probably poor anyway. But does anybody have any favorite movies that they think I should check out? And no gay porno names, I don't. That was a long time ago. I mean like good movies that I may not have seen. Uh, leave me some comments down below. I will see if I can check those movies out, or I will tell you that I have seen them already, if you want to. If you don't want to, then whatever, don't care. It just gives you something to do, and it gives me something to do as we coast out the remainder of our existence together. Well, if any of you churin are watching, which you probably shouldn't be watching this show, but if you are, and you are going out trick-or-treating tonight, don't be stupid. Look both ways before you cross the road. Try to follow the law. Don't egg people's houses or their vehicles. Let's just get as much candy as we can and try to get diabetes together. But seriously, be careful. No one wants any deaths on Halloween. Unless you just really don't like the person. And even then, it's still kind of messed up. But be safe tonight. Don't eat any razor blade shaped candy, if that's a thing. 
And if it's not a thing, definitely don't eat it because it's probably fake candy that's actually a razor blade. But having said that, I'm the Rifter. Please like, share, and subscribe. I appreciate it, although I do still hate all of you. Don't trust Whitey.